Hi, it's Harry from Weave & Blend here, giving you a walkthrough of our app Invoice Scheduler. It's the most powerful invoicing app for HubSpot and Xero. We built Invoice Scheduler because we recognise that invoicing needs to fit around your business process. So we created the most flexible, user-friendly invoicing app out there, letting you do invoices your way. That means better visibility for your sales and operations teams, no more copying and pasting, and happy finance departments. So let's dive on in on an end-to-end -end walkthrough. If you want to explore anything in more detail, get in touch for a personalized demo or sign up for our free trial. It all starts with a deal. You can see that this one's been signed off. It's got a contact and company attached. And for this demo, we're using HubSpot quotes. So we have line items already attached to our deal. To start creating invoices, just find the app in the sidebar and click Create Invoice Schedule. Here's our start screen. You just choose the number of invoices you'd like and hit start. We also have autofill enabled here, which will fill in those line items for you automatically. We also support monthly, quarterly and annual invoices, along with deposit payments. This will create identical invoices for each time period you pick and calculate the dates automatically. We'll even pre-select these options and the invoice quantity for you if it's included in your HubSpot quote. For this demo, I'm going to split our deal into two different payments. So I'm going to choose two invoices. Here I can see my invoice, filled in with the line items from my quote. Everything here is editable, so you can make it how you want it to look. You can create new items, drag and drop, and even duplicate line items. And in the top corner, I can check that the total I'm invoicing matches my HubSpot deal. Now, I just need to pick the dates. This one is going out this month, and the second invoice is going out a month later. Moving to the sidebar, these settings are pulled straight from zero. The company name is matched automatically, but I can search or create a new zero contact record without leaving the app, and will even pre-fill the contact data from your HubSpot records. Here, you can enter a reference field to show on your invoice, such as an internal project code or PO number, we can even autofill this from our property on your HubSpot deal. Next is currency, and we support every currency that Xero does. Here you can select account codes and taxes, again all direct from Xero. You can set them for the whole deal, or if you have different account codes for different line items, you can do that too. You can also autofill them from your HubSpot products. So, looks like we're ready to sync our invoices to Xero. We just hit the button and off we go. The invoices will enter zero as drafts, ready for your finance team to check and approve. Moving to zero, I can see all my invoices filled out correctly. And let's see what happens with a little bit of magic when my invoices are paid. Before that though, we have a number of automation triggers available in your dashboard. You can change the deal stage in your pipeline. For example, move to a paid stage or update a property on your deal. This means you can do some pretty cool stuff with HubSpot workflows like notify a deal owner when invoices are paid or rotate to customer success once a deposit has been paid. Let's look back at our deal. We've had our timeline event to show that one of our invoices has been paid and looking back at the app, I can see the status. These invoices are locked now that they're approved, so they can't be edited, but more invoices can be added if you need to. So that's the end-to-end -end process. Our users have reported huge time savings by streamlining their workflows and they've improved the productivity of their sales and finance teams. If you want to find out more, just try our free trial or book a personalized demo now. Thanks for watching.